hello students so we have finished the story of adventures of don quick thought as well as the important textual question answers from this chapter and after this today we are going to discuss the textual grammar that has been included here and before going to tell you the name of the grammar or the name of the topic i shall show you some examples here example number 1 is mr quicksana was a short thin man and number b is sanchu panza was a short bulky man so student here in the first example the words short and thin again in the second example the words short and bulky these words they are helping us identify the people they are describing in the first example these words are i describing mr quicksana and in the second example they are describing miss sancho panza and student these words which are describing these persons are called adjectives and yes students this is our today's topic of discussion that is adjectives so students from the examples that i have included here i hope that you have got some idea of what are the adjectives and we got to know that adjectives are the words which define modify or tell us more about the noun or pronouns they appear with so students a uh, an adjective always appear or comes along with a noun or a pronoun so student you already know that what are the nouns nouns means the naming word and pronouns means the replacing word like he she it all this which replaces the noun like the names so i hope that you have understood that what are the adjectives these are the words we shows the quality of the noun of a noun or a pronoun in a sentence here again i have included two examples number 1 is sancho panza was a so honest but simple and number b is john quick sort is muddle headed here student if i ask you to identify the noun so in the first example the noun is sancho panza and in the second example the noun is john quicksort now student you all know that the adjectives describe the nouns now in the first example the sancho panza the noun which words are describing sancho panza they are honest and simple again in the second example which word describing the noun don quick sort it is muddle headed so in this way you can identify the adjectives in a sentence first of all you have to identify the noun in a sentence like i have done this at first i have identify the nouns and if the noun is not there you have to identify the pronoun so first of all you have to find out the noun and the pronoun in the sentence that then after that you have to find out the words which are describing the nouns or pronouns in a sentence so students i hope that you have well understood what are adjectives and its Uh, examples and i also hope that if i now give you some assignment or task to identify 
adjectives in a sentence you will do it correctly that's why before proceeding further about this topic i am going to give you the home assignments of today's class as this is a new topic that's why i am not proceeding further relating to this topic i am just keeping it very simple with the definition and examples of adjectives only for today and this is your home assignment for today's class please note down this in your class work copy including today's date and try to do it the answer by yourself only and students after few days i'll try to give the answer of these questions and these are very simple if you can identify the nouns in these sentences you can easily identify the adjectives also so students this is the end of our today's class in tomorrow's class we shall proceed further with the topic of adjective thank you so